We start tonight in Evansville, where the owner of a gas station tells us at least 1,000 gallons of diesel fuel was stolen from their business. And they say it's not the first time that much fuel has been stolen from there. Eyewitness News Ann Powell with new information and the surveillance video tonight. These losses really do hurt. Evansville police responded to the Marathon Station along the 1300 block of Interstate Drive near Burkhart and Lynch on Tuesday. Jose Braza owns a gas station and says the thieves broke into a pump but around 1130 Monday night. And they break the lock on the, the gas pump and then they bypass security and just start filling up into uh, canisters in the bed of their truck. Security cameras caught the suspects and shows a red truck and a white truck. Hard to see any face or anything like that and they're completely covered in uh, winter clothes so it's just a little bit tough to uh, see what they what they look like unfortunately. Raza says each truck had 500 gallon containers in the bed that the thieves filled with diesel fuel. In total he says 1,000 gallons were stolen. And if you calculate the current price of diesel, which is 475, it equals up to about four thousand um, seven hundred and fifty dollars. He says it is a hefty loss between being a small business and having a slower crowd in the winter months. He says it will take a while to bounce back. It's been kind of tough for us. Insurance doesn't usually act quick, so it comes out of our pocket immediately. Uh, losing a thousand gallons, gallons of diesel. Um, hurts because then we have to ask for another delivery sooner than what we were expecting. This is the second time the gas station has been hit. In October, he says the same thing happened. Two people stole 1,000 gallons of diesel. Last time they also stole about 1,000 gallons. And um, yeah, so this is the second time the police has uh, come to our store for this exact reason. If you have any information, call Evansville Police. In Evansville and Powell, Eyewitness News.